My dear Whitney, look at you. What a beautiful bride you are. This day is the day all mothers dream of when they first hold that precious bundle of joy. There was another person who cherished and loved you to the very core of his being. You called him your hero. Your father. <laughs> I know if he were here today, he would be in with joy. Getting to witness his baby girl marry the one whom her soul loves. God had other plans for you and Papa on this wedding day. However, there's an old tradition for brides to the rhyme of something old, something new, something borrowed, something blue. Papa is here with you today, bringing with him the part of the tradition, something blue. Located under the train of your dress is a piece of a piece of his heart in blue to foster the old tradition of something blue. He will be here today walking you down the aisle to give you to the one your soul loves. Whitney Anna Marie Cher and Joshua Smitty have come together this afternoon to be wed to one another to look at a future together in marriage. We both know our journey started quite unexpectedly and not ideally in the graces of God. We both struggled with the disappointment we felt we had created, but then that all changed the day Stephanie was born. And my love for you changed when I first saw how much love you had for Stephanie. always told me early in our relationship, especially after we found out you were pregnant, you did not want me to settle. I vow to you today, I do not see myself as settling because I have the best gift God could send anyone, you and Steph. I promise to be your faithful husband, your encourager, loving you when the sun shines, when the rain falls, in sickness, and in health. I vow to help shoulder our challenges for there is nothing we cannot face together. Let me be the shoulder you lean on, the rock on which you rest, <laughs> the companion of your life. For with you by my side, I will walk my path from this day forward. days with you by my side seeking God first. You are my best friend, my mentor, but most importantly you are the one my soul loves and you make me happier than I could ever imagine and you love me more than I could have ever thought possible. So I am truly blessed to be a part of your life which as of today becomes our life together always and forever. It is by the authority invested in me by the Constitution and the laws of this state. It is now my honor to pronounce you husband and wife. Now the beautiful part, Joshua, you may kiss your bride. be a part of a joining of two people that truly are in love.
these two met, something has changed. Whitney is not exactly the same person she was before. She was strong before, but she is even stronger now. And she, while she was happy then, she is even happier now. Through the good times and the bad, they have stuck it out through all the laughs, all that I'm never getting married, but yet here we are today.